You know how at times you just feel absolutely beaten down by the enemy? You feel kicked, uh, just walked over, and when you think it can't get worse, it does. This is welcome to spiritual warfare. Uh, this is something all Christians go through, but I want to give you some good news and some encouragement if you're going through it and you're feeling like giving up or it's never going to get better. I have a technique for you to battle as according to Ephesians 6 through 12. This is not a fleshly battle, but it's spiritual. So there is life and death in the tongue according to scripture. So what I like to do is to declare over my life some of God's promises because remember when you declare it, it moves in the spiritual realm. So according to, uh, let's start with Jeremiah 29, 11. I know the plans I have for you, plans for hope and a good future, not to harm you. I declare that and I go, thank you, Lord, for those promises. Or, you know, nobody will pluck you from the Father's hands. That means nobody will be able to take me out of the plans that God has for me. Another one that I like to use is greater he that is in me than the one that lives in this world. And I declare over my life. And when I am feeling, guys, whew, when I'm feeling weak, all right, and this happens to me, I'm not above reproach with any of this. I go through this just like the rest of everybody else. It's a constant. But when I feel weak or uh, I feel like giving up, I go, the joy of the Lord is my strength. And I keep declaring it over my life. And I'm telling you, things happen in the spiritual realm when you take authority and you declare that and you, you make it come to fruition by saying it. And so when you speak that into your, about your life, you'll start to see things change. Even though in the moment, maybe you don't believe or feel it, but understand the more you speak it, the more things will change. So declare that over your life. All right. And I hope this helps somebody today. And remember to cast your cares on him because Yahweh cares about you. Love you guys.